A Green Bay family is counting its blessings after finding out the cat they thought they lost in a car crash last month actually survived. The crash happened more than 600 miles away in Berea, Kentucky on July 26th. Fox 11's Kristen Crowley has more on the story. This family is made up of six members, Randy Schumacher, his fiancee Faye Alexander, their three children, Chris, Miranda, and Aaron, and their cat, Tiger. He means the world to me. He's my favorite cat. He's also my first cat. On July 26th, the family was driving back to Green Bay from a trip to South Carolina. Tiger was in uh, the trailer in a pet taxi. The rest of the family was in the car with Alexander behind the wheel. Two semis uh, passed us, one on the right hand side, one on the left. The one on the left uh, came so close it kind of created a vacuum. Last thing I remember was hitting the concrete wall. The car and trailer were totaled. Luckily, everyone escaped the crash with only minor injuries, but Tiger was missing in the debris. I saw his pet taxi was in there and broken, and he was gone. When I looked back and seen the camp after everything was over, I didn't see how he would be able to make it. I actually told Randy, I said, we're not leaving Kentucky without him. Alive or dead, I want to know. They stayed in Kentucky for three days, tirelessly searching. On the third day, they finally returned home empty-handed. It's like leaving, it, leaving your child behind. It was awful. I was very sad when, I, when we lost him because I thought I'd never see him again. But a phone call exactly two weeks after the crash changed everything. Someone at a Humane Society in Kentucky found Tiger alive. I was shocked. I mean that it had been as long as it had been. I had pretty much convinced myself that he was probably didn't make it. And the kids start crying and planning a party for when he gets here, a tuna fish cake. Schumacher says he doesn't know how Tiger survived, but at this point the how doesn't matter and like the rest of the family, just wants to get Tiger home. I was so happy. I almost started crying. I'm, I'm glad that, that people are taking care of him. I'm just grateful. I am so grateful. Arrangements are being made to reunite the sixth member of the family okay. later this week. In Green Bay, Kristen Crowley, Fox 11 News. The family is working with the Humane Society in Kentucky to shuttle Tiger back home. We'll keep you posted.